Hey, this is Jason, and I finally got around to putting the uh, cup holders in my 99 Discovery 1. Uh, what I bought was this guy here, and it basically sits on the side. And when it's sitting on the side, you screw two holes to hold it in. So it basically sits just like that. And there's a screw at the top, and there's one on the side underneath here. I haven't put it in yet. You're all going to have to drill into the uh, car, the plastic. I did a small pilot hole, and then away it went. I caution you in saying that because if you uh, once you do that, if you decide you don't like them, you can have holes. I think I, uh, I'll be okay with it, with the functionality of having a better cup holder set up than it was from the manufacturer with this little guy that pulls out. Make sure when you position it, you can shift everything okay, put the diff in okay, and go into four low and four high okay. Pretty easy. All I did was sit it, I drilled my pilot hole with it sitting, and then I just screwed it in. It took maybe 15 seconds. So that's all I got to show you. Check out my blog, jams.net. That's www.jamsandmomszandzebra.net. And you can see projects on this Disco One as well as a Range Rover Classic and an L322. I'm only making these videos, even though it's probably self-explanatory if you buy the cup holders. If you're like me, it's always nice just to watch and make sure that the way you're thinking about it is the right way. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.